amongst the millions settling down to watch the final Game of Thrones episode with the Belfast locals who helped to get it on air. The extras playing noble women, feuding family members, tribal fighters, even dogs who were recruited when the scene required wolves. The award-winning fantasy epic has run for eight nail-biting, cliff-hanging series. And now it's over. Oh, yeah. You were Jon Snow's double. I was, yeah, yeah. yeah. And yeah. I saw that being shot like a year ago, and I've kept it for a year. You kept yeah. that secret for a year? I have, yeah. It's such a closure yeah. moment, and everything winding down was really emotional. It was perfect. It was the perfect ending to the best TV show in the world. Game of Thrones has had its base in Belfast for the past decade. For the extras, the technicians, the actors, it's changed everything. Oi. Brennick O'Connor appeared in some of the series' most famous scenes. I envy anyone doing drama in Belfast now because you've got this growing hub, this new Hollywood, if you like, coming through into Belfast. Um, and it's all right on your doorstep. It's really buzz off statues and we don't so much. He went on to appear in the hit comedy series Derry Girls, also filmed in Belfast. Since Game of Thrones' arrival here, the police drama Line of Duty has moved to the city too. Stephanie McCutcheon learned the skills of TV production by working her way up the ladder on each series of Thrones. Now, she and many others are in big demand. I'm not saying that there wasn't an industry here before, there was, but nothing like, uh, you know, hundreds of people, thousands of people uh, were employed by this show. Game of Thrones has left its mark all over Belfast. From this exhibition to the skilled TV workforce, the brand new studios and production houses, and the government tax incentive the show led to, designed to lure more quality TV programmes to Northern Ireland. 27 Apple, take one. Mark. Action. Right now, the TV detective series Marcella is in town. Production on the entire third series moved to Belfast. Many of the crew, the same as on Game of Thrones. The fantasy epic may have finished, but with a prequel in the works, its legacy here continues. Nina Nanar, News at 10 in Belfast.